Oh, well, holy crap. I have got a Juga in my hand. I just picked this one up. There's a few of them around here. That's why I came here. And as I picked this one up, a bird flew out of this hole in the ground. And I looked in, and there's tiny little birdies just hatched. So I'm gonna have to get out of here right away, pretty much, because the parent is watching, but I scared the hell out of him. I'll just quickly film the little birds inside for you to see, but then I'm moving out so as not to needlessly scare the parent anymore or the little birds. Okay, look at those guys. I will not cause any harm to them. Let me grab my camera a little better. Well, I didn't expect that, so I didn't have a chance to watch which bird flew out of there. Not sure. But that's about it. I'm moving out of this area. These little guys need their parents to look after them. I'm approaching the nest I saw before. The little bird nest. It's in that cavity in the ground. Right there. I maintain the distance just in case they're still there. The other day the parent remained inside until I was very close. Hopefully they haven't moved out. Let me try to get a little closer. Oh shit. Crap. Scared the living crap out of me. So the parent's still there. That means the little ones are still there. I'll just check quickly on them. They're slightly bigger now. It's still very little. Yeah, I'll leave them alone. Better need to return and look after them. Wish I were able to catch which bird it was. It flew out so fast. I'm once again approaching the bird's nest. <laughs> oh, but I gotta stop because I got a slime mold here. Oh, I'm fascinated by slime molds. <laughs> That's fantastic. Anyway, I'm once again approaching the bird's nest. Two days later. I'm very curious what happened now, how big the birds are. And I don't want to scare the parents too much. But I want to keep a document of how they're growing. I'm going to have to be very delicate about this. Not to cause too much needless stress. I'll we'll still capture the images. Yeah, the little birds are definitely getting bigger. You see them moving in there. Wish I could capture the parent a little better so I knew which species of bird they are. I'm going to try to get a little closer without causing any disturbance. Yeah, so the parent is not there right now. Birds are getting bigger. There's the view from up on the slope. Birds are definitely growing up. Seem healthy. So we need to get much closer to count them up. Oh, yeah, you're a hungry little guy? Of course you are. You need a lot of food to grow up. So three for sure. I'm guessing more, maybe four or five. Okay, I think I've been here long enough. I'm gonna walk away so the parent can return and look after them. They are getting fluffier, growing feathers bit by bit, and then getting bigger for sure. I'm still not sure which species of bird that is. At least four of them would be five. Okay, they're cute, they're beautiful, but it's time for me to go. The parents definitely nearby. I don't want to stress them too much. A little bit of short footage from a distance every couple of days or so and hopefully that's good enough to document their development how they grow up how they form into full-fledged birds looking forward to learning who they are 
okay not gonna go any closer not gonna stay much longer thank you birdies keep growing keep getting stronger i'll see you again another day so how are my little birdies doing today still see movement Ah, it's just mosquito landed on me. That's great. Now where's my home? Okay. okay. There they are. The mosquitoes. What the? I'll shut the recording off and I'll return to it when I got this mosquito on me. Well, the little birdies are still there. But for some reason I don't see the parents much anymore. Granted, I don't come here often. The birds are growing. Hopefully everything's fine. Seems to be so far. Still can't recognize which species they are. Hopefully it becomes clearer in the next couple days. I was able to get rid of that mosquito, but it got me before it was eliminated. Anyway, I'm not sure if these are seed-eating birds or insects catching birds but I brought some seeds to help the parents out as a little compensation to make up for the disturbance I've caused when I originally stumbled across this nest so there's the nest and I'm just gonna toss some of those seeds in there I appreciate it and I'm sorry for the disturbance I've caused. May grow strong and healthy. See you again next time. I'm back in the mosquito infested area coming to check up on my little birds. Yesterday I got bitten pretty good. Not gonna get closer per usual. But the little ones are still there. Don't see the parent again. So, the lady's head count suggests there's six of them, six little birds. Yeah, I definitely see six beaks. I'm going to sprinkle a few more seeds again. Hopefully that helps them out, helps the parents out, so these guys can grow into full-fledged adults. And for seeds, the nest is right there. I'm gonna sprinkle the seeds about like before. Hopefully parents can find it, get strong from it so they can keep the little ones strong. And my bird's nest is empty. Huh. Two days have passed, the birds are gone. So that must mean they have fledged and are learning to fly. They're out and about now. Learning to sing, to vocalize, to fly, and to do their bird thing. And I just happened to hear a lot of wrens singing around. And I'm guessing that's who the birds were. Eurasian wrens. Tiny little walnut-sized birds. So we had a new clutch. I don't presume a predator came and ate them. They grow up fast, these birds. From hatchling to fledgling, this little passerine should have been a matter of days. So we got more rents in the woods. Good to know. Considering how small they are, they sure have loud voices. Awesome. I don't think these birds reuse their nests, so I don't think I'm gonna find them in the same place next year. But that was exciting nevertheless. Hope they're all healthy and will grow up into full-fledged adults, keeping the population of annoying insects down. So I found the fledglings from the nest. Little wrens, Eurasian wrens. Tiny little walnut-sized birds. They hold their tail cocked up. And these are the little fledglings. They're learning to fly now. They're a little shy, but they're out of the nest already. 
safe and sound. These are my baby birds from the nest. I wonder if they'll remember me as they grow up. A little wrens. Oh, beauty. My little baby wrens are here. They recognize me. They remember me. So sweet. Thanks for coming to greet me. You're absolutely amazing. Thank you so much.